is definitely ask questions. You want to ask questions that that, that make sense, such as like um, about the key fob thing. That's super important because you want to know how the guests are going to get the keys, um, or clients are going to get the keys. You want to know how what their requirements are for this one. They wanted the background check, which a lot of people um, just hear from because they don't want to go through that rigorous having to do a background check per person. However, it's nice if you have like more of the long stay guests. A lot of people don't want um, short term, two short term guests. They want like three, four months guests or six months. So that one, this would be a great option for that. And then they keep the key pop. Unfortunately, it's the only one. So if there's ever an issue, they need an apartment or they lose it or something. You want to ask those questions too, how much is it to place it? Um, and you want to know for, for your long, longer term guests, which we say it's like over four months. Yes. They're kind of used to going through background checks and stuff um, right. because they know that they're going to be there for an extended the same time. They may have guests coming in now. They may have an animal that they um, might bring. So you also want to look at that. And they are um, animal dog friendly, cat friendly, I believe too. You see, they have a dog park. You want to, you know, look at all the menus and all the things that may be available. Yeah, they have. They let you use the room for events and stuff. So that's important to ask questions like that. How much is going to cost? So you know how much you can charge them, and then you can charge your fees on top of that. Piece. So right. <laughs> if they're only charge, if they're charging a thousand dollars for inside and out, you can charge them. Fifteen hundred or two thousand dollars or whatever, you, and you make a profit off of that as well. So it's another way to increase your um, your revenue as well, and it's, it's nice because they a lot of people want event spaces, nice spaces. People would love a space like this. Um, they rent it with an apartment, and then they have a space to hold like birthday parties or baby showers or, or whatever. It's definitely beneficial um, yeah. to maximize on it. And again, like as you guys were saying, like think about it. Like okay, they're not you know. A great fan of the short-term rentals, SCRs, yeah. and those LCRs. What are those? What are kind of people that come for that? Traveling nurses, uh, tra uh, professional clients, corporate, that rental, kind of yeah. corporate rentals. Um, you have those that are transitioning, moving to the area, mm -hmm. so they need that six-month um, time frame. So they'll like the stability and all you know the bells and whistles, especially with this property that it has. Yeah. So you're not going to lose out on a background check that we do ourselves that costs you know, pennies on a dollar, maybe about fifteen dollars. So do a background check besides there. So that just definitely offers stuff that's normal for the Yeah. Um and they do free background checks, which is super nice. I mean you got people that may be renovating or something like that. They it could take three months sometimes and it's like extended six months or longer. So you never know how long they're gonna be in that. So you can go on places like Furn um you can list on places like Furnish Finder, Copa, um the nurses website, I can't think of the name right now, but they, they mostly go through furniture Final too, but there is a couple of nursery websites. You can also talk to local um, travel nurse agencies for any people that they may have in the area um, that they may be sending to this area, you know, like she said, the travel nurses, or even nurses that are just in the area, they may be in transition for whatever reason. Um, the insurance getting, companies, yes, um, especially for the housing, mm -hmm. something like that. If someone's getting their house built, it's taking possibly maybe a year to do so. Mm -hmm. So they're looking for those terms of three to six months or six to nine months mm -hmm. or something like that. Yeah. So that works. Yeah, it's definitely good to network with your people, like any any of the um, staff agencies, like I said, travel or corporate agencies, because they can and let them know that you just want people that need to stay for six months or more or four months, because those four months are normally extended to six months anyway. So you can do. Um, a minimum stay of four months so that they know who to refer you to. And then you just have people call me like, hey, do you have this availability? If you don't have the availability, and they do, you can get that availability. And they'll go ahead and send you a check ahead of time. So you use that money to, to get this. So you're, you're moving them in with, with nothing. And they're yeah. paying for your furniture um, and everything. Zero dollars. <laughs> zero dollars. Zero dollars. You, you're just the, the middle the middleman in, mm -hmm. in you know, the so transaction. You know, yeah, so they're, yeah, they're, they're telling you like, hey, we need this amount of units. And you go like, hey, I need this amount of units. And you get a few here and a few there. You send them the pictures of the units that they'll be getting and you're and you're done. And, and a video clip if you like, you send them up, you know, so that they know what it looks like. Mm -hmm. um, it'll be unfurnished at that point. But right. when you furnish it, you can, you know, and you can up. get a company to furnish it. Yes, a, a short to, stay, to stage it. Yeah. So it's not actually coming out of your pocket. So yes. You know, like hundred two hundred dollars a month, and then you just charge them a little bit more on top of that. So you might charge them five hundred a month for the furnishings of the um, of the entire room, right. and then you just go buy the little stuff like you know covers and toiletries, all the yeah. things, the amenities that they might need while they're there. And usually for the longer uh, term rentals too, you're gonna give them a little bit more than you would do for short term rentals. Mm -hmm. um, exactly. As far as the toilet papers and stuff like that, tissue, 
Yeah. Et cetera, so. so don't let um, like all the requirements deter you from doing it. You be like, no, I don't want to do that. I want to be able to get the last minute and the short term. So don't let that deter you because there's so many options out there and there's a niche for everybody and for everything that yes. you can always find. You know, one man's obstacle is another man, <laughs> man's success, right? you know. Another so, thing. I'm yeah. ready to climb this one. I said, oh, that's all you need? Because it wasn't a no. It wasn't mm. saying we don't do this. We just require this. We just require this because um, they don't want a lot of people coming in and out. They want the more people that stay there a little bit longer. And, you know, and it, it is a, more of a sense of them knowing most of the people that are here. Mm -hmm. um, it is a higher end place. Like, you definitely want to charge that. Like, you're charging for these amenities because they're Correct. all included. So, so the least... I would charge on a place like yes, this. Please, please tell me. I have a figure. Right? The least, <laughs> the least, or... the least would, the least, least, least. If there's nothing going on, I would say 200 a night. But you could definitely go up. I mean, places like this, you could definitely do 500 a night easy. And the location you know. is everything. We're yes. right here by the stadiums and yeah. the arenas. So, like the prime time for these games, 200 is on the regular. But yeah. on the high end, you are like 400. Mm -hmm. A night just because of what's offered here. So and don't let yeah. yeah. And the events right here, the stadium being yes. right there, don't let that. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm excited. <laughs> yeah, that's way more. Than that's that. what. Like, that's that's way more. And then yeah. you have the pool that's all season round. Yes. Um. So that's. That's, that's not. Thing? That's not a thing like in the area right. because of the seasons. A lot of people shut down after Memorial Day. Um, so having that, a lot of people are always asking, is the pool open? Is the pool open? The fact that it's open and that it's heated and that there's two. Yes. And you can have events. Yes. Like a lot, well, I know specific, specifically for Airbnb, they're not even allowing most events like that. So right. you wouldn't even get people from there. You would be getting direct connections that will book through you, through your own website or through your payment link. Say that again. Say that again. See, not everything is just Airbnb. Yes, Airbnb. Direct booking. It's where it's, it's at. where it's at. Yeah. Because now you have a different control over it right. um, of your traffic that's coming through. And, you, and it's more money for yes. you because you're not paying their, you're not having their fee on top yes. of it or their hosting fee. You're Correct. getting the money directly. Pay your taxes out of it. You know, if you have your accountant or whatnot, and not, you know, we're not a CPA. Look, look yeah, CPA. That. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, CPA. But, um, can definitely look into that. But yeah, you can definitely. Um, you can definitely make money in this area and then the fact that they're building transportation here mm -hmm. and also with your nurses and corporate housing sometimes they don't want to pay that fee by themselves so this was perfect because they have the roommate style where it has their own wash and dryer in each separate room which is super nice because then you can you can have them Dedic they can be there dedicated bathrooms dedicated wash and dryer right they just shared that um mm -hmm. The common space area, right? Which is just the kitchen and the living room area, but they have so much going on. They have that sense um, of privacy, which is you, super nice. You'll make sure they have their own TV entertainment, but again, if they wanted to entertain, but the way this facility, maybe others like pertain to this one, they have so many entertaining areas that's outside of the unit itself. So it, when it comes to privacy, or wanting that you know alone time, it, it's something that could be done. So and another thing you can think about is if you're renting. For each room, if you're renting each room out, you have the. I was right there. Really? I was right there. That's <laughs> where right, my hand was. You took it if out. You're renting each room out. You yeah. actually end up making more money because yes. you could charge one person. You might charge them 200 night, and the other person you charge 200 night. So then you get 400 night for something that you would have or could have just charged 200 for the entire place. That's like you know 2100 for the week. Exactly. Easy. And you know. your rent, um, you get a deal on the rent. Right. You know, you can have your rent paid that week, and then add everything after that is profit. And always ask, what do you offer, and what else can you offer on top? Don't, yes. Don't be afraid to ask. What's yeah. the other discount? Ask the specials. If you if you get more than one unit, right. they'll normally give you a one month free, even two months free rent. Mm -hmm. So the first two months, the first two months, you're making nothing but profit. You know, and then that that first month will give you the yes. third month's rent. So then you're actually ahead of rent. You know, paying your stuff ahead of time instead of being on time or, you know, that's you, where you, you definitely want to make sure you're at least a month or two ahead of rent, which is nice because if you do have a slow month, guess what? Well, you, you got two months for rent, so there's no reason for you to you not have to scale. Pay that, yeah. and you want to leave a little bit in the pot to handle anything else that happens. So yeah, we so. normally always try to negotiate at least two months. Right? Always. But if you could do one month, that's that's perfect because you want to get it set up within three days. So you get it set up within three days. You go ahead and have your your people like, hey, we got another unit or another three, five, ten units in this area. Who you got? Who you, um, who you who have you right now? Exactly. It's hot on the market. This is what it's offering for a limited time. You let them know this is immediate. So it's a yeah. call to action and urgency on their part to say, yes, I want to take this. Mm -hmm. What's happening? 
yeah. and then a lot of times we do direct booking say you had people that came to another location that you have you let them know listen hey i have this going on if you're ever in this area for events you can take care of that as well exactly so yeah that works so if you have people that just want to book um because you have that if you have people that just want to book events and they don't necessarily need the room what you can do is charge them for the event as well as you can mm -hmm. charge them when I stay, but it's it's included in that price, if that makes sense. Yes. You just quote them for that price for just, um, if they're not staying, you definitely want to give them a little bit higher price mm -hmm. um, just to cover, you know, anything that um, damages or whatever that may, that may or may not occur. One Hopefully thing then. I know we did fail to um, ask them about was as far as their internet and all that. Um, I did ask them. We did what no, Yeah, and you always want to ask them what's included. But there's no internet included, but the ballet trash is included. But they do have discounts on like local providers in the area for that as well. But yeah, um, a lot of the questions that we asked, I'm trying to think of some of the questions we asked. Um, the inter okay, so as of internet, the, the, the entrance, the key entrance as far as the prop to go in and yeah. out, um, the amenities that's offered, what's the discounts that's offered as well, um, if you get more than one unit at a time. Um, what else did we ask? You want to ask about the security uh, security, yes. security systems because that's important entry of them getting in and out the building make sure it's secure because you do have a lot of people that may get off work late or early in the morning um you want to make sure that you're in a good safe area it's well lit and you can see some of that stuff for yourself but that anybody can't just get in the building uh, and you want to ask because we do this one is a super nice one a lot of people like your a lot of the corporate clients they want like cleaning service especially like clients even out of the country yes. they want like cleaning services so that they don't have to do their own laundry which is nice because this um, complex does offer that and they can and the turnaround time is 48 hours so that's some another amazing that you can charge extra for right. <laughs> and then they can get and they get it back within 48 hours because you you know during the week people don't definitely off the to top it. of that to say yeah. you have access to that do one fee for having access to it mm -hmm. and then they're paying for you know whatever mm -hmm. so, and it's it's penthouse style so people love love that and then they're going to pay extra for it because they're like okay this is super nice rooftop pool advanced and they have access to mm -hmm. all of it yeah it's all on the marketing of how you're doing these units it's not, it's, it's an experience right right everyone that's coming into town they're getting an experience mm -hmm. um with what the unit that you're staging for your airbnbs or whatever platform that you're using mm -hmm. um it's just a, definitely a re reflection of you uh, yeah. what you're offering um and you're simulating and definitely making it a selling point it has this why wouldn't you want to be here get here now this is what makes us stand out from the rest exactly besides your decor yeah and honestly this is where you want to be at because then you don't have that turnaround time with your cleaners and stuff you know for the cleaners mm. it's good because they they're coming in and out a lot but with a units like this where you're staying six months that's less turnaround time you have so the corporate say corp uh, uh, corporate rental company they, they send you the thing and they send it to you and they get it for they're sending you say the six months they're going to send you the, the contract and the money for that entire six months that you're getting up front so that's money in your pocket. So you can be anywhere. Like this right. is a business you can be anywhere, and you have six months to schedule a cleaner to come out there. So this is this is where you want to be at. You you know in the beginning, yeah, you want to get those those nightlies, those yes. weeklies. You know that's you know, nice. But when you get to the point where it doesn't matter about that, you can get the six month term. That's two tenants that you have for the entire year. Yes. And, like, it, and, and it's set and yeah. you could offer the cleaning services if they were like in between right um yeah. you say okay we could offer this again you could charge for that if you would like a cleaning mm -hmm. that's another way so you already have that six months ahead mm -hmm. if they want to do that additional that's extra profit yeah. so now you're able to scale with that money mm -hmm. all right your overhead is taken care of for the next six months you want to make sure you're dedicating doing that as well mm -hmm. and while this is already maintaining itself and running itself now you're able to go obtain other properties and exactly and get more locally or out outside of you know the region. right so this is a you know duplicatable process yes. you just keep going and going and adding mm -hmm. and so you could be out on the beach or anywhere you want to be and you're just collecting checks mm -hmm. at the at that point you know you're getting paid and then you just you can pay your rent up for the entire year and the rest is just profit it's already for you could get somebody to come out there and furnish it and there's even companies which we'll talk about i guess in another video yes. that um actually will furnish their whole apartment for you for free Yes. And we probably will leave some affiliate links, I guess, for you guys as well yes. to see if we can get a couple dis discounts as far as um, that offer other products that and offer all different that. products that you can use in your um, your your rental, your rental unit, unit. unit. Yeah, <laughs> so that <laughs> it gets like even cheaper, like just your regular household products, like cover sheets and all that stuff, a one-stop shop, so you can get all those things, uh, quality items because 
quality brings quality. You know, you have quality right. items, you're going to bring quality clients that's just going to be right. willing to pay that money and not blink twice. You have your other customers that may not have the means and they're going to try to <laughs> negotiate right. a discount. So you can have properties available for all, um, all kinds of uh, backgrounds, people, that areas that mm -hmm. people want to be in. Because there's another unit um, that we have as well that we, that, we, that's more affordable for, for people so, right. that don't have the money exactly. to pay places so you, like you that. definitely have the, the different, yeah. um, this, what's going to work for different demographics. You never know what's a person's mm -hmm. situation. Yeah. You just want to be able to offer from this end to that, from the lower end to the high end. Yeah. Um, they're all good. You're still going to offer that quality, that experience, mm -hmm. because it's the rest of you definitely making sure they're getting the most out of it. Um, but knowing that you're building relationships, like how we get off of it, excuse me, off of it, able yeah. to offer yeah. products, <laughs> yeah. you know, and all of these extra amenities on top of what is already offered at these places is extremely important. You know, like yeah. I said, your network is your net worth yeah. in everything that you do. So um, we actually do have another one that we to yeah. check out as well. So. Yeah. And there's one last thing I want to mention as far as the, the furniture. With the furniture, not only is it that you can put the furniture in the a rental for free, but you can also get paid off of the furniture for if they want to buy any of those items. So there's so much, there's so many opportunities out there, guys. Like money should never be able to hold you back or be an issue for you. There's always ways, you know, to, to be able to get what you want and not have to put anything down. So with us, we just started with, um, honestly, it was a, honestly, 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 first of all, we just started with a couple hundred dollars. Like, look, hundred. I can't put no more than a couple hundred in here. Like, that's it. And honestly, we did not spend more than maybe three hundred dollars for our first one. And for some people, that may be a lot. And at the time, you know, for us, we were like, okay, I'll do three hundred. But you can. There's other investors. We we actually have people that helped um, invest and, and put in, and they don't care. Like, they're like, here, here's the money. And this is what I want out. back, and you work out a deal. So you know, so options. you don't have to put any money out there if you don't want to. You know, you pay you pay your people back and that's it. Like you start but, off like that and then yeah. people was actually able to come from under that umbrella quickly as well. Yeah. Um, because we realized and just moving quickly. Not slow moving, we're not turtle moving over here. We're doing like the hair. We're moving really fast. Yeah. To we make it happen fast. because we scale really fast because we understand how the market is and everything that's going on in the market, events, the turnaround on what we're in 2022 now. Things look differently than it did last year and the year before. If you guys didn't know, there was a slow season when it came to this, but now we're definitely moving even at an accelerated pace because yeah. everything's back open again. Yeah, so well, because of that, that, you want to definitely capitalize upon that and don't miss that because sure. everyone wants to go out, you know, and enjoy themselves. They mm -hmm. definitely have the place for them to stay. Yeah.